What's up guys? How you guys doing today? So today guys, don't forget to be a bit different and have some fun and be yourself guys. But it is currently July 1st at 12.05 p.m. And I just got finished filming my Buffalo video. We just got back from Buffalo. So and I changed my shirt so that it's a Canada Day shirt. Yeah, so it is Canada Day. Um, I'm going to be celebrating Canada Day tomorrow or later today. Yeah, so it is also my mother's birthday, so we're having a little like birthday party, and we're also celebrating Canada Day. So it should be fun. And I have my Canadian socks over here. I'm contemplating to wear either Team Canada socks or these like these Canadian socks say stuff like um, like A and like other Canadian stuff on here like uh, 1867 stuff like that so I'm either gonna wear these ones or those ones I haven't really decided but I'm just gonna go downstairs and make sure I finish uh, like editing uh, the Buffalo video so that it is posted yesterday I guess it would be but yeah so I just gotta go edit that video So um, it's now like 1.16, I finished the video, it is ready to upload today, but a lot of trades have happened in sports and a lot of crazy things have happened in sports, but I'll talk about that later, I don't know when I'll talk about that, probably in tomorrow's video because there will probably be a lot more trades, but we're just preparing for our Canada Day celebration right now, and yeah, so I'll try to see if I can get some fireworks, but I'm going to decorate the front cover of my journal because it needs a bit of colors and stuff added to it. So I think that's what I'm going to do when I'm watching Murdoch. But yeah, so I don't know if like the so the first time um, we had the like I've, I recorded when it was Can uh, Canada Day, it was it was like the fireworks where we saw them outside at our friend's house. And then last year, we were at a cottage, so I don't know if that can be today, but we'll see, we'll see, we're just gonna work with what we have, Buffalo was fun, but now we're back, and yeah, so I'm excited for what is to happen tonight, but um, I'm gonna talk about a couple trades right now, and the rest in tomorrow's video. The Penguins got two new players, sadly Phil Kessel is not on Pittsburgh anymore, he got traded for Alex Galchenyuk. Phil Kessel, you did what you had to do, buddy. And, like, he brought in two Stanley Cups. And now he's gone to Arizona. Which Arizona has a really good fighting chance now. And Rick Tockett brought him in because Rick Tockett was on Pittsburgh um, when they won the two Cups. So now he's on Arizona with Rick Tockett. But... It's uh, Alex Galchenyuk is not a bad player too. He's a pretty good replacement, so hopefully he will be good next year. And then in Pittsburgh today signed Brandon Tanev to like a six-year contract, and Brandon Tanev was on Winnipeg. Um, Brandon Tanev is also a really really good player, so hopefully he will be good fit on Pittsburgh. But yeah, so those are the two trades that I've gone. Oh, also, Oli Mata is not no longer on Pittsburgh anymore. He got traded. Uh, I forget who he got traded for, but he's a really young player. He got traded to Chicago. But yeah, so those are the three trades that have happened to Pittsburgh. So I'm just going to go downstairs and decorate my journal book and watch Murdoch. Now 4:42. People are said to arrive at five, and yeah, so it's gonna be interesting tonight. It's gonna be fun though. We're having like um, hamburgers and just little stuff like that. It, it should be fun though. I'm like excited for the party that's gonna happen tonight. We just organized everything. But my dad gave me a book, and it is Blimo. Yes, it's where he works. And if I open it, it's similar to the one that I got 
The other book is from his old work, and so I'm going to put the cover here, and then I'll be like, start writing there, and then all the pages. This is for my Italy book. Yeah, so it should be interesting. My other book is coming along well. I did design it. I, I added some, like, colors to it so that it looks so much better now. But, yeah, so... Honestly, I love writing now that it's like that writing something about something rather than like, I don't know. It's just fun, but a lot of trades and signings and everything has gone down in the NHL. I don't know. It's, it's pretty crazy right now, it seems. But yeah, so I've honestly just been watching Murdoch for a little past while and um, I'll probably pick up the camera sometime soon probably when stuff gets interesting yeah so i'll see you guys then so a little bit of time has passed now it's like 6 26 i'm just gonna go in the pool now and just swim in the pool but it is still so nice outside. There is a lot of people here now, so I'm just gonna put on my swim trunks and hit the pool. But yeah, so we're probably gonna have dinner more or less to like 7.30, 8-ish, I don't know. But the only person that hasn't been like anything with today is Mitch Marner. He hasn't been signed or traded away like he has it, the Leafs have assigned him or has it been signed by any other team or they haven't traded him or anything like that. Nothing has happened to him. You haven't heard anything about him. The Leafs did trade like about, they had three different trades with Ottawa. I don't know why Ottawa, why you traded, I don't know. It doesn't make any sense to me, but they do have, the Leafs have Jason Spezza now. So, I don't know. Maybe that's what they were trying to do. But who knows, who knows, man. I don't, I don't, I don't know. But yeah, so I'm about to go back outside, hop, hop in the pool, and then I'll catch you guys later. So it is now 7:11, and uh, yeah, so it's it's just like. I don't know, it's still pretty nice outside and uh, just enjoying the day, honestly. This day has been fun since you come home from Buffalo. It's been a very crazy day, but um, honestly, I don't know. There, Mitch Marner still hasn't signed. Um, he's still he's still up for the for anybody, any team, honestly. But I have a feeling that like he has been signed. It's just like I don't think no like nobody knows because. They don't want it out there yet, or like, oh, I don't know what's going on. But the this time last year, the same day, John Tavares went to the Leafs, and I don't know. I think Marner, something happened, maybe signed right already, but like at 7 and 12, and like, I don't, he hasn't done anything yet. Or at least they haven't announced anything yet. I think something has happened, but they just haven't announced it. But yeah, so our dinner's ready. It's just like, come and serve first come first serve pretty much right now and I haven't got anything because I was in the pool I just got out but yeah so I'm just gonna enjoy some hamburgers and salad so it's quarter to ten now and it's dark outside and there are fireworks going off I don't know if you guys can hear that but it's they're going off so I want to see if I can get a little bit closer to the action I don't know what's going on with my door but it's like closing awkwardly but we just had cake and dinner and honestly it's been a fun night we were playing basketball baseball everything we were doing everything even with my broken finger but yeah so I'm gonna go try and see if I can get closer to the action
did record some firework shots, but they were really, really hard to get. So it's now almost 10.30, a minute to 10.30, but a lot has gone on in the past little while since I recorded. So we went to this place called Clear Meadow, and it's a school. And well, we 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 were play we were we were like out back uh, outside my house, and then we saw like there was fireworks going on, and I suspected they were at this like the clear meadow. So uh, we went to the clear meadow, and like there was there was a bunch of people there, and it was a bit sketchy. I'm not gonna lie, honestly, um, cause I don't know. I don't know, probably shouldn't say the reason why I'll just put in my journal um, but yeah so we we went over there and um, there was a bunch of teenagers probably around 15 around that 16 and they they were just like fireworks with people they lit them off on the ground so they just went like outward and it did, it was really really sketchy and then they lit it off towards the school so I was like oh, I, should, I probably should go so we went back and then we got back to the house and then buddy buddy next door he was firing them off off his deck and this happened on the May 2 4 weekend too and it was like it was come on buddy like what's, what what are you doing and so we my my dad went out there and he's he told him to give her a rest, but it was more than that. But, um, so we stopped, and he was, um, so he's probably not going to do it again now that he's done it twice over his deck. And so it was honestly pretty interesting. Those fireworks came hard to get. I was just outside my lawn, and I, they were offered to, like, the, uh, like, a, a court near the Clear Meadow, just off of Clear Meadow. So I just recorded them to the best that I could. They weren't as cool as last year but they were the best I could do this year but yeah so honestly it was pretty interesting the past like since I recorded probably like half an hour to an hour but I'm just gonna go watch Murdoch and I got it on my my computer now so that I can just watch it while I'm doing my journal so I'm just halfway through an episode I believe I think it's halfway through something like that but I'm just watching Murdoch on the on the uh the computer and with my gum, life's good, honestly, life's not bad. But uh, yeah, so I'm just gonna do my journal, write about what happened today. It might take up two pages, honestly. But uh, yeah, so honestly, it was a very eventful July 1st, 2019. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna write my journal and I'll catch back with you guys after. my journal for today it's currently 11 16 and I'm probably gonna go to bed soon I've just been watching Murdoch while I was doing it it's pretty pretty enjoyable I finished one episode and I'm on to the next one but yeah so I did do the cover earlier today and this is what the cover looks like now it's just got summer six summer of 19 and that's like a beach ball type thing there and I just made it colorful. There's like an anchor, ice cream cone, a seashell, a camera. And that's supposed to be like me egg in a way, I guess. I don't know. I'm not the greatest artist, but yeah. So here's the today's day. So I did decided to take a Polaroid picture, which I thought it was a cool way to add something to it. But I titled it Canada Day 2019, 0701-19. Uh, yeah, so I just made this and it's Canada Day 19. And so here we go. Today I woke up at 7 a.m. because we had to go back to the to home today, and uh, and we had the breakfast at the hotel, which was just, honestly it was like really really good breakfast. This hotel is very very good for that stuff. Um, but and then we were we were on our way home, and then we we got prepared for our party, and then everyone came at five. My aunt was there. The neighbors were there. My nana was there, all the neighbors were there, and then we got in the pool, as you guys know. And then uh, we had salad and hamburgers for dinner, and honestly, it was really good, like I said. And then we played Keep It Up with a beach ball, and then I got onto another page, 
and then I said the backyard and did backyard until we hit the balls over the fence and then I had to hop the fence which was like a bit of a process and I had to get the balls back which I did and then we heard fireworks so we went to go investigate so we walked to the clear meadow school and it was, I said it was a bit sketchy because honestly it was so we walked back and then I said buddy was buddy behind us was setting off fireworks uh, on his decks and then my dad confronted him and said a couple choice words and then buddy stopped we we came we then had ice cream cake and then that was my day so yeah and then uh, I also have the Canada flag uh, fireworks symbol 1867 when Canada was founded and then July 1st which is like the Canada day so honestly it was it was it was really fun today and uh, it was it was just really cool and it was just a really fun day I love writing these journals these journals are really cool and I'm glad I, I put this into it like a little Polaroid picture I don't know I think it just looks really much better than just putting like blank just pages and I don't know this this looks really cool I'm glad I could do pictures like that I'm gonna color them uh, red tomorrow like this red when I get the crowns from downstairs so yeah honestly it is just fun and uh, I'm probably just gonna go back to watching Murdoch right now just on the TV or not on the TV, I don't know what I'm going on about, but on the uh, computer. But yeah, so um, I'm going to watch that and then I'll catch back with you guys later. I just kind of colored the outline of those images here, but I still got to make them red so that it's like Canada Day. But honestly, I've just been finishing my Murdoch episode and it is now done. So I do believe this is going to come to the part of the day where I do have to end off the video. So I do believe that is going to have to end off today's video. So I basically like to thank you guys so much for watching. I do hope you guys enjoyed. And if you like to watch another video guys, please subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn on my post notifications, and smash that like button. Smash. See you so much, Wines. Peace out. I will see you guys in tomorrow's video.